We'll begin by using the New Design from File tool to select the Lift Point Simplify Fusion Archive file. After clicking OK to open the file, save it to your active project. Simplification of the model can be used to remove features that will add processing time and not affect the ultimate result of the model. The simplification workspace in Fusion 360 can be done to explore different designs as well. We'll begin by refreshing the results of the current simulation. And after a moment, we're able to see the peak stress of the model and where the stress concentration is around where the washer contacts the body. Select Simplify from the toolbar to go into the Simplify workspace. What we'll do in this exercise is explore different options for this design without changing the CAD data. By right-clicking on the simulation model, you can select Clone Simulation Model from the context menu. A dialog will appear asking if you want to maintain the study that is currently attached to the simulation model. Select OK to copy both the simulation model and the study attached to it. The first design variation we want to explore is to remove the collars from the design. By expanding the model components and selecting the collars, you can remove them. Then use the Press Pull tool to reduce the size of the holes by 2 mm. When you're done, select Finish Simplify. This will return you back to the simulation workspace where you'll see the new simulation model with the study. The study has a failing at this point because the force was initially attached to the inside of the collar faces. You'll edit the force to select the faces of the holes instead and reorient the direction of the force without changing any of the values. At this time, you could run a simulation again, but instead, go back to the Simplify workspace. With the no collars version of the design created and the forces applied properly, let's clone that simulation model as well. Again, keep the study that's attached to the simulation model. And for the simulation model 3, what we want to do is remove features. You can select any given face and simply use the delete tool to remove faces from the model. For this model, there are a lot of fillets to be removed. So instead of selecting them individually and deleting them, you can use the remove features tool. Selecting the body will give you a number of different features that could be removed. Holes, extrusions, and fillets. We'll deselect select all and select fillet. By changing the feature size slide bar, you can change which features would be selected. For this design, I just want to remove the fillets that go around the base of the main features. Selecting the delete icon at the bottom of the dialog will remove them from the model. After closing the dialog, you can start the press pull tool and select all of the same edges plus a few additional edges. When all of the edges have been selected, We'll set the radius at 1.5 millimeters. Then pick Finish Simplify to return to the simulation workspace. After returning to the simulation workspace, we see that there are no warnings for this new simulation model, so we can select Solve. When the Solve dialog appears, it's set to Local because that's how the last solution was run. But one of the great features of using cloud solving is to be able to solve multiple studies at the same time. To solve both of our studies at the same time, choose on cloud and then select the two studies. The two studies will be uploaded to the cloud and when complete, the results of the active study will be displayed. Reviewing the results of the study is the same whether the study was done on the cloud or locally, but to get the best idea of what the better version of my design is, I'll compare all of the results at once. Expanding the simulation models and selecting the various studies using Control in Windows or Command in Mac, you can then right-click and select Compare. This will bring all of the studies up on the screen at the same time. We see right away that all three models have a very high safety factor, and we can switch the results to display anything we like. So change them all to stress, and you can get a better idea of what the stress values are between the three design options so you can make better choices about the future of this design.